This is the Bosch Colt router, and it's a nice little router. We've been using it for several years here in the popular woodworking shop. Earlier this year, Bosch released a plunge base for the Colt. The motor unclamps from the fixed base. drops into the plunge base and then locks with a clamp. So the handles are nicely positioned. I can reach the uh, switch with my thumb without taking my hands off the router and the plunge mechanism is right there. When you release the plunge mechanism the router stays in place and there are pretty standard turret stop depth adjustment. The other nice feature of this is the plunge base accepts the standard Bosch router edge guide. So if you have a bigger Bosch router, you can use the same guide on the cold as you do. I'm set up here to route some mortises. Now you'll see a lot of intricate jigs for doing this, but you really don't need them. If you have two pieces, you can clamp them together and the second piece will stabilize the router for the cut. Now one of the nice things about setting up for a plunge router is you can just gently set the cutter on the surface then make your fence adjustments. The other thing I like to do is route to the full depth at each end of the mortise and then I don't need stops to set the length of it. Now when I route, I can hear when I get to the end the motor will stop. So by controlling the plunge mechanism, I'm dropping down about an eighth of an inch on each pass. So the plunge base is a nice addition to a nice little router.